going to be a few guys that we're going to have to share at bats. But we also expected there were a couple of guys who probably wouldn't. Freddie Galvis, who seems right. to play every day. In fact, he did last year in Philly. Also, Eric Hosmer does the same for the Royals. Now he's doing what you'd hope for the Padres. And for more on Eric, let's get you down to the field. Check in with Bob Scanlon. Hey, Bob. And Mike, thanks. And as you said, it's been a little bit of a revolving door in the outfield. But the constant on the infield has been Eric Hosmer. He's been everything that the Padres expected. We've talked a lot about his defense, but I don't know if we've given him enough love for his offense. Hitting 313, a 414 on base percentage. And here's some of the damage that he did on this last road trip. Hit it up the middle, doubles to the gaps, doubles opposite field. He has done it all, guys. He had five multi-hit ball games on this road trip. He's hit six of his last seven safely, and he leads all of Major League Baseball right now with eight multi-hit ball games. The thing that I love about watching him hit is that he uses the entire field. When you look at his spray chart of home runs over the last six seasons, it's from right field to left field and everything in between. He hits righties, he's been hitting lefties, and I love that he is clutch. He's hit 375 so far with runners in scoring position, and 750 with two outs and runners in scoring position. Guys, he's been everything that the Padres had hoped for and more so far. Back yeah.